Hi there, Chris here. Um, some people wanted to see these little um, external combustion engines. Um, they're, they're Stirling engines. And they're external combustion because the heat um, is on the outside. This is a little alcohol burner. Hello little alcohol burner and your car has the spark or the heat generator on the inside in a spark plug this is on the outside so it's considered a external combustion engine and the principle they work on um, or the way they work is you heat the air in this little tube I guess I should have cleaned that off a little bit it's a glass tube. Um, and you heat the air in here. Now in this chamber that you see going back and forth, there's either air or helium. And it's, it's going to be cooler. So... The heat surrounding it is hot, but it's cool, and as it cycles, the heat builds up, builds up, and it pushes this back, and as it does that, there's some, somewhere there's an intake, um, and it cools this off enough so it's going to go back this way, and then it, the heat pushes it back, and because it's on this flywheel, let's see, can do this yeah maybe not because it's on this flywheel and these pistons and it's counterbalanced here once you get enough energy exchange happening uh, it'll run um, this is the same principle um, you put this on top of say a coffee cup that's an iced coffee cup at the moment, but you can put it on a hot one. Let's see if we can get that in frame. And the hot air heats up the bottom part, and there's a bellows in there. If you look carefully, can you see that? I guess you can't. That's really tough. I'll get it over here. There you go. Now you can see it. See, there's a bellows. So the, the hot air... Um, pushes this up and it cycles around and, and the cam pushes it back down and it also is cooler up here than it is with your hot coffee or hot water down here. Now because it really does work on the difference in the temperatures, um, a good question is, well, what if I stick the bottom part on an ice block and the top part is hotter, will it work? Well, the answer is yes, it will work. It's not quite as efficient because if you have hot water coming from your coffee cup going up, um, I mean, it's, it's, it's all hitting here. If you're putting this on an ice block, um, it doesn't, now <laughs> we have Suki now. We might have to move her when we light this thing up. Um, it doesn't quite, make as good a, a efficient con cool contact on here but it does run and it, I mean it'll it'll run and run and run um, if this is hot if this is uh, 100 degrees centigrade water you put it on here it'll run at least a half an hour before the differential of the hot and the cold is um, equalized enough so that this will stop running anyway how are we going to do this with Suki I don't want to set Suki on fire. Hasuk. So, nor tip this over. Let's see. Maybe we can adjust things here. That will probably work. Yeah, actually, she's just too close. Come on, Suki. Not gonna like it. I know this is your domain, but oh my god, you're heavy. Alright, you go. Yeah, do something else.
All right. So what we're going to do is fire this up, light it up. We'll get this and maybe zoom in a little bit. Okay. Um, it also goes down to this little generator and it generates electricity because it spins that little generator and it generates electricity and it'll light up this little LED bulb. So we'll light this. It takes a minute or so. Oh, I forgot to turn off the music. Oh well. So I don't know if you can see the flame, but there's a little flame under there. No soup. And if I give it a little push, not quite hot enough. What, did we lose our flame? That's never happened before, but, you know, obviously because it's on video. But um, it's going to happen. I also have the air conditioner, so there's a little bit of... A little bit of cool breeze behind us. All right, we're relit. We're gonna give that chamber the full amount of air to heat up. Meanwhile, <laughs> it probably's not ready yet. Almost. getting there so but once it gets there it, it'll really go and it, it can go so fast this thing will, even with rubber feet on this mat will start walking away um, there it goes so it's you know a continuous cycle of heating in, in uh, having cool air come in and cool and heat and cool and heat and cool and it just keeps going and if I put this in here you can barely see that <clears throat> we'll get the little light to work okay wrong way But then you get this little light show and evidently there's some sort of program in there. That makes it, it'll pulse different colors and then it'll flash different colors and go back and forth. If I stabilize this, I mean there is so, it's, it's very solid but still if I stabilize this, it runs slightly faster because it's not giving up that that energy vibrating. So that is the Sterling uh, external combustion engine. And it's a very cool little thing. They're not very expensive. You Got it on Amazon. The little blue lines, didn't, it didn't come that way, or these blue lines. But while it was running, I just took my permanent marker and just held it on there to make those lines. So if I take this away, it still has a fair amount of energy. Uh, the heat differential is still great enough so it can uh, continue to run. You can see it slowing down. If I take the little bulb out, ouch, if I take the little bulb out, oh, 
Usually it speeds up, but we're going to put the heat on again, put the bulb in, take the bulb out. Oops, you go the wrong way. It really, I don't know, it shorts it out or something. Kind of like my chandelier. There we go. So that, um, that's it. It is a very cool thing, and there's, they make these in all kinds of different configurations. You have the coffee cup one, you have this, you have it, some of them are, are mounted on wood, some of them are more intricate. This is sort of not an entry level one, the coffee cup one is sort of an entry level one. But they have a more in intricate, and but this one's pretty damn cool. Anyway, I thought I would show that. It's not like sport, but it is interesting. All right, um, leave a comment, hit the like, say hello to Suki. Um, I'm going to shut this down before I bring down the lock lab. And we'll see you next time.